channel. Um, hmm. So I think you guys can establish that I am super inconsistent. Sorry. It's just me. I don't know. I like try to get on a schedule and every time I try to like get on a schedule to do like filming and upload videos, something happens. Like, it's like life says, ha ha, no schedule for you. I don't know. I'm not going to get in depth with in depth with things because I don't know I feel like it's always something like there's so much like I wouldn't even know where to begin and then this whole video would turn into me rambling about just stuff instead of doing what we're all here to do which is makeup so I'm just I don't know I think I'm really just gonna do a simple just a simple matte well, hold on, don't let me lie to you. Eh, I might do a little shimmer, but for the most part, I think I'm just going to do matte colors. Um, I'm going to use the Too Faced Natural Eyes palette today. If you haven't seen it, they redid it. Like, they came out, they redid, like, the formula and re-released it. So, this is one of, like, their older palettes, and then they redid it. So, this is the new version of it. It smells divine. It's so like, I want to say chocolatey, coconutty esque. I don't know. It smells wonderful. So, anyway, I think I'm just going to use that. I got to get ready because I'm going to have to go out in a bit. And obviously, I am ready for October. I'm good with September. September can come because weather, the weather has been like a lot cooler. It's going to get back up into the 90s, but then it's going to dip back down into like the 80s and the like high 60s at night, which oh, that is my jam. Like that, oh, I can't explain to you guys enough how much I love autumn, fall, whatever. Like that is my jam. I love it. Mm. So anyway. Let's just jump right in. I've already, I don't know, I already washed my face and put lotion on. So I think I'm going to use this Makeup Forever um, Step 1 Skin Equalizer Base Hydrating Primer. It probably came in a box because I did not buy this and it's little. And you guys know my fetish with like little mini products and trial sizes and whatevers. And it's super creamy. So we're just gonna dab some of that on and blend it in. Do not mind my little um, friend. Like I did my eyebrows and I don't know if there's an ingrown hair pimple thing happening. That's life. That's life, you guys. So we're just gonna go with it. Um, I don't know. Yeah, I was gonna spray my face, but I think I'm just gonna go with that. I'm gonna go in with the Naked Skin One and Done. Next, and I mix the two colors together: the medium light and the light. Go pump of that. And then I just mix it on the back of my hand. Put that stuff all over my face. You all do not want to see my hair today. Mm. Mm -mm. My hair is a hot damn mess. Like, I can't even. But I do have a new sponge. I'm excited about that. Definitely made my day. And then I'm just going to blend it out. And then next I'm going to go in with my Naked Skin Weightless um, Concealer. And I'm just going to put that over my red spots. Under my eye.
anywhere that I get redness. That and then blend it out. And then I'm gonna go in with the same concealer but in the color light. Just to, ooh, no, no, I'm not. Yes, I am. So I have a, one was almost empty and I couldn't, I don't know, I just grabbed both of them. So I'm gonna go in next with the color light and just lighten up under my eye. center of my face and then I'm just going to take that same um, damp sponge and just blend it in. Now obviously if you don't have like a lot of redness or spots you don't need to put on the darker color and then put on the lighter color. Like if you put on your foundation and everything's pretty much even and you don't have the redness then skip that spot. That's just me. That's just my skin. It's just what I prefer to do because I do have redness so basically putting on that darker color I'm canceling out the red and then I have a nice canvas so to speak so then I can lighten the other colors up the other colors so then I can lighten the other area up so let's see and then I'm going to go ahead and set it with my Tarte um, smooth operator setting powder oh well I guess I should show you the back I don't even know if that like shows up but this thing is such a pain to get the powder out of and I'm just going to use my Sigma, oh, it's rubbing off, tapered highlighter brush, the F35. And I'm just going to use that powder and set my under eye. And I really get the brush in there and move it around so the powder can get like up in the bristles. And then you go both directions, I go out and then I pat back, back in. I'm going to go ahead and do my brows. I don't do anything crazy with them. Just brush my hairs in the right direction. And then I'll lightly fill them in. And that was just my Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Definer uh, pencil in medium brown. I am terrible with going through, like I'll show some stuff and then like other times I'm just like, oh, I'm gonna do this. Sorry, like, I don't know. See, and I was getting ready to do it. So now I'm gonna go in with my Essence Make Me Brow um, gel brow mascara, eyebrow gel mascara. And I'm just gonna brush through Keep those hairs right where they need to be. That's that. So I'm all done with that. And then I think, I think, I think, I think, I think. Hmm. I'm just going to go in and do my eyes. So I showed you the palette. So I'm going to use... The Too Faced palette, natural eyes. And I'm gonna go in with my Morphe E27. Ooh. 
my Morphe E27 brush, just a fluffy brush, and I'm going to go in with this color Strip Poker. And I'm just going to put that all over my lid. It's got a bit of fallout, and I'm going to tap the excess off. Bunny. It's just a light chocolatey, milk chocolatey brown. And I'm going to put that on my, I love this brush, this Moda Pro BMX 430 brush. It's a crease brush. It's just a fluffy crease brush. So I'm going to pick that color up, tap off the excess, and then this brush just does all the work. I'm just going to go through my crease. And blend that color. Sometimes I'll do like little circular motions and then blend it across. Sorry if the color is a little off. And then I'm gonna um, just take that same brush and just go underneath my eye. I'm just gonna get my shadow brush. It's flat. It's an Urban Decay. There's the sun. And then I'm gonna go in with this color Sexpresso. It's a really dark chocolatey color. And I'm gonna put that all over the lid. So I'm going to go in and just brush that off. And then I'm going to go back in with that crease brush and just blend out those harsh edges. like a little patchy on the camera I don't know like what I'm seeing like right in here on the lid it's seeming to be a tad bit patchy hmm I don't know guys Curl those bad boys 
And then I got this mascara in hmm, a box. I don't know. I, I don't remember. I think it was my Boxy Charm, or it could have been the Ipsy bag. I don't remember. Wonder Beauty um, Unlashed Volume and Curl Mascara. Uh, just kidding. So I really have been wanting to try it. It's quite interesting. So it's got like a squeezy tube, and then there's the brush. So far, I like it. Let's see, and then I think I'm gonna go in with, uh, I think it's the NARS Rue Bonaparte, Rue Bonaparte um, liner, and I'm just gonna put that on my lower lash line, and you know I need to get all up in the mirror, so hold on. So it just lightens up underneath the under eye because I did such a dark lid, and it's just kinda smoky. I like to um, lighten up the lower lash line. Let's go ahead, I'm gonna go ahead and use my butter bronzer and bronze up my face. And I'm gonna use this Morphe tapered fluffy brush. And I'm gonna take my, oh, or just kidding, just kidding. I'm gonna take my Sweet Peach Glow palette and I'm gonna use the blush. And I'm gonna use this Morphe E4. Tapered fluffy brush. to shut off it doesn't say it overheated and it's not out of space thinking it's just in a mood today it drives me crazy but like I'm picking it up my daughter says that all the time she's like that's a mood I'm like I'm gonna show you a mood but then it like sticks with me and I'm like oh I don't know like just now I'm like oh that's a mood kid rubs off on me drives me crazy um, thinking that's it. I'm gonna go in with this tart lip paint in Pillow Talk. Ooh. I'll give that a minute to uh, get a little drier on my lips. So again, I did dark eyes, so I'm gonna go with a lighter nude lip. I think I wanna try this ColourPop Ultra Glossy Lip in Hypnotize. See, it's got a little iridescence to it. I'm just gonna apply a little bit of that over top. Mm, cause yeah, now they're like super sticky. I'm just gonna dab it on there. Because I really don't want to pick up any. Of that nude color. Because I don't want that color in. The tube. Here we go. Add just a little bit of 
just give it a gloss, a little bit of shine, and then I'm going to go in with my Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. There you have it, folks. That is my easy, lazy, easy, whichever, whichever you want to do. Quick and easy, um, every day, whenever you feel like it look. So how about that? All right, guys. Um, thanks for stopping by my channel. Hope you enjoyed this look. It really is super easy, so I don't know. Just try it see what happens. You can use any colors you want on your lids just as long as you go with like the dark and the light like I did. You can do whatever you want. You can highlight, you can put lashes on. I just didn't feel like it because I'm just being lazy and this was it. I mean you see my hair. I just threw this thing on and threw my hair up and this is how we're going to roll today. But anyway, thanks for stopping by. I'm trying to get consistent. Thursdays and Sundays. Depends on how that goes, maybe I'll throw on a Tuesday. I don't know. Tuesdays and Thursdays, maybe? Maybe? I don't know. We'll see. We'll try to stick with Thursdays and Sundays for my uploads. But um, if there's anything that you want to see, any palettes, um, any colored eye looks, just throw it out there. Leave me a comment. As always, constructive criticism is welcome. Negativity is not. If you're coming here to be nasty, don't waste my time. You don't have to watch my videos, so don't watch it just to be negative and nasty. No point. Go somewhere else. Go watch something else. But if you're here, have fun. Hope you enjoy it. Yeah. So, thanks for stopping by. Bye.